what's going on. So today I want to talk about my honest experience working with Nick Co. And it's been interesting. Nick is one of the most interesting people you will ever have the opportunity to meet because he's very, he's very good at business. Um, he's also very quirky. And unless you know him personally, you won't know that. So Nick, I had the opportunity to film one of his videos. Um, and I've been to his house multiple times, quite a bit actually, because we used to have immersion training at one point at his house. So I've been to his house and um, I've gotten to know him a bit personally as well. And what I can say is I, I greatly appreciate I guess the fact that he took that step to create RSD in the first place, because I think that had it just been Owen, it would have been very, very difficult for, for him to build a business alone, right? If it was just Owen. But the fact that Nick came in and he had the initiative to start the company, I'm not really sure how it went down. So I, I assume this is what happened. But I think that what happened was Nick had that business vision, the entrepreneurial vision to start RSD. And he just took action on it because Nick is an action taker. When you meet him, he's pretty ruthless in terms of um, like if it's not done right, then he'll let you know. And he's very fast to take action. So that's the part, I think that's what really made RSD successful in the first place was his decisiveness and his willingness to take massive action. Because I remember when I filmed that video with him, we went to the golf course and we were basically filming a few scenes. Um, it was actually my fault that the camera equipment wasn't really working properly. And um, I, was, I was taking longer than I should have to, to set things up. So we actually ran out of time on the golf course to film more content so we went back to his house and he was just like, well, do you want to just finish it up now? And it was already like the sun was setting. It was already dark. And uh, he just jumped into it and got it done in one take. That's the crazy part is that, you know, with most people, they take multiple takes, including Owen. Owen, I, I know this, that he's, he has a very high standard for himself. And so he takes a lot of uh, different takes when he's on camera. But when it comes to Nick, he's the opposite where he's just like, we're just going to get it done. Boom, one take and it's over. <laughs> um, and Nick is funny because when you get to know him, you know that his cats come first over anything else. I wonder if he had to choose between RSD or his cats what he would choose but he loves his cats and uh, he has a lot of little interesting quirks yeah he's he's a very interesting character um but he is pretty ruthless when it comes to business and sometimes that can put people off he's polarizing is what i can say um some people like that and could put other people off because he's very aggressive. But I also think that that's what you need. That's what makes him a great business person in terms of getting things started and getting things moving. I think the contrast between him and Derek as business people is that Nick is more in alignment with the take action. If you make mistakes, just go and fix it sort of thing. Um, with Derek, I can tell he's, he's very meticulous and strategic when it comes to business. And Derek has a very good understanding of economics and the global markets. So he has a more macro perspective on things too. I mean, maybe Nick also has that as well, but I'm not really sure what his background on econ is. But that's pretty much all I have to say about Nick. I would say, you know, I, I've gotten the chance to spend some time with him. Uh, he was really inviting. This is something that I really liked was he was very inviting in terms of letting RSD employees uh, stay at his house sometimes. And, you know, when times were difficult, he was always 
willing to welcome people into his home, which is cool. Yeah, Nick, Nick is a good guy. And I think that we, uh, we got along because we have that Asian connection. So I think he appreciated that. And I think also just, I don't know, maybe I'm just uh, making this up, but I feel like he saw that I had work ethic as well. And I think that's one of his big values. So that's all I have to say. I'll wrap this video up now, but um, hopefully you found this interesting or at least entertaining. All right, take care.